Hello everyone. So today's Panda's interview question is change the value Y to yes and N to no in Anupam column in Shark Tank India all pitches data frame. So there are certain times when in a data frame, there are certain values which are not appropriate or which are not interpretable. So many of the times it is being asked to us that change that particular value name to some other name. So similarly, in this question, it is being asked to us that change the value Y to yes and N to no in a column of Shark Tank India All Pitches data frame named as Anupam. So quickly, we'll see how does that data frame looks like and how do we do change the Y to yes and N to no. So first, I'll import the library Panda. Pandas. So I'll import Pandas as PD. I'll run it then i'll read my data frame into a memory and store that data frame into a variable called df so i'll say df equals to pd dot read underscore csv and then i'll just copy the data frame directly from here dot csv now let me check the first five row of the data frame so i'll say df dot head when I said df.add, the first five row got retrieved out. Now I could see that there is a column called Anupam. And in this column, we have values like n, n, y, n, n, where this n is actually means no, and this y actually means yes. So the question is, change this n to no and this y to yes. So I'll teach you two methods. Uh, by the help of first method, I'll convert this n to no. And by the help of second method, I'll convert this Y to yes. Let's see how do we do it. So first I'll select the column Anupam. So I'll say DF of Anupam. Then the functionality to replace any value in that particular column is called as dot replace and parentheses. And inside this parentheses, what we'll say, we'll take a dictionary. Now, you know that a dictionary is a key value pair. So basically we have to put the things that need to get changed at the key of the dictionary and the value, which is, which is supposed to be in place of that change value as the value of that dictionary. So I'll say that N then colon no. So basically I'm saying, Hey, wherever you see N, you just convert this into no. Let me run this. When I run this, I see that this N got converted to no, and this Y is still intact because we have not changed the Y. But whatever the output has come, it has not reflected the original data frame. In order to make a reflection in the original data frame, we have to put one more parameter called as in place equals to true. Oops, that true has to be in capital T. Now the changes has got affected in the original data frame. Let me just run my df dot head again to see my data frame. Now, when I run df dot head, I could clearly see in Anupam column, the N has got converted to no, and the Y is still intacted. Okay. So this was the first method of converting something. Now the second method is a bit lo longer, but this is also one of the method to do manipulations on the data sets inside. So first, what do you do? You select your column. So I'll say DF of Anupam, and then I'll say dot map. Now this map functionality takes a certain function and maps to each and every element of the series. So inside this map function, I'm going to put a Lambda function because Lambda is an ad hoc function and immediate, immediately I can create a function and make it in use. So I'll say Lambda X colon. Then I'll write the if else condition that if, if X, X equals to Y, then all you need to do is to write yes so the if condition is 
written that the moment that x is equals to y, convert that y into yes. But we should always remember that lambda function must return something. So we have to use an else condition also. So in else, I'll say, if not, if the condition is not satisfied, thus just return the x itself. So whatever the value of x is, let's say it went over here. It says that it's written no. So this is not equal to y, but no. So leave it like as it is, just return back the no as it is. So all the things will get returned back like this only. So whatever the resultant thing is coming, I need to store it somewhere. So I'll say df of anupam equal to this thing. So whatever result is coming, it will get overwritten to your df anupam column. Let's run this. Let's check your df dot head. When you check your df dot head, you see wherever y was there, it got converted to yes using math functionality. Okay. Thank you.